U.S. Senate candidate Jim, Jim Lehman from Arizona visited Yuma today to host a Latino Coalition Roundtable event. Yeah, News 11's Samantha Bird brings us this one-on-one -on -one interview with the candidate. U.S. Senate candidate Jim Lehman discussed immigration, jobs, water issues, and agriculture, topics that impact Yuma on a daily basis. Jim Lehman is a veteran serving six years as an Army Airborne officer with three of those years in Germany during the Cold War. Lehman sold his company at the end of 2021 to focus on his run for the Senate. Lehman says it's his eighth trip to Yuma since he began his campaign, hosting a roundtable discussion full of Latino business owners. The Latino vote, the Hispanic side, because I'm all in. My company looks just like America. When I built it, 1,732%. Latino Americans, I'm out there with them, hands-on kind of guy gone through these policies with them as well. Local business owners were able to address Lehman with any concerns they had regarding their line of work. Pack the room, as you can see back there, standing room only, because they also were concerned about water, about illegal immigration. They want a good uh, visa program. Lehman continued to speak on the issues of immigration and water, the top two priorities on his list when it comes to Yuma. We have a great legal immigration system in this country. It's the most bountiful on earth. We must secure that southern border. Number two, water. I'm a big infrastructure guy. I've been fortunate to be in business all my life after six years as military officer. There are currently eight other Republican candidates running for U.S. Senate in Arizona. The winning Republican candidate will then run against a Democratic candidate in November. The 2022 Arizona primary election will take place on August 2nd to elect the next U.S. Senator for Arizona, among other positions at the local, state, and federal level. Keep tuning in as election season heats up. Reporting in studio, Samantha Bird, News 11. Sammy, thanks. And the Yuma 